hello students welcome back today i am going to start a new chapter that is chapter number 3 working with windows 7 so today's content is creating files and folders and opening and renaming files and folders now before creating files or folders you need to understand what are files and folders so if you look at the desktop you can clearly identify the files and folders because you can easily differentiate files from folders with the help of the icons that are associated with them now if you see these yellow color icons we call these as a folders and other than this whatever the icons you can see we call those icons as a file now whatever work you do on a computer it is stored as a file for example you might draw the picture in the paint or you may create a document in the microsoft word or download a movie from the internet so we all save this as a separate file that is why a file is a collection of data stored in the form of text it may be a picture music or video now see <coughs> at home your parents may have a briefcase or a suitcase now what they usually keep on the briefcase they usually keep their files on the briefcase or say within a box or within a suitcase you may put another suitcase smaller suitcase inside it so folders are basically used to store files and other folders inside it a folder within a folder is called subfolder so just like a file the folder also has its name now i will show you how to create a file first suppose <coughs> you can think this one this is my microsoft word document you need to type few things here so just think that i have typed this text so i after typing the text you have to go to the office button or a file menu and click on save or save as so after clicking on the save as so you will get a save as dialog box like the one that is shown so here you will see your file name in the file name you have to give one name for this file means for this document so you can type any name for this file and after typing the file name click on save so this file will get saved by that particular name now i will show you how to create a folder so creating folder is very simple what you need to do is say suppose say in my desktop you have to right click the mouse button let me repeat once again you need to right click the mouse button after right clicking the mouse button you will see a drop down menu from this drop down menu go at the new option now once you click on the new option you will see another sub option from this sub option click on this folder option so just click on this folder option now here you can see a folder and you can see new folder here so in this new folder you have to give the name for the folder suppose let me give the name as say class say class 4 and press enter key so this is my folder with the name class 4b now how will you open the folder just take the mouse pointer here and simply double click on this folder just double click the mouse button your folder gets open now right now there is nothing inside your folder so what you need to do is you have to bring the files and even other folders and you can place it inside the folder just like you place your say your clothes inside the cupboard or a suitcase so let me close it now see how can you place other files and folders inside it you can simply click on the file suppose say this is my microsoft document file so click on the file and simply drag and put it inside your folder so simply 
go into your folder and leave the mouse button so what happened your files got stored inside this folder now if you want to put another folder inside the folder so you suppose say this folder or a module paper so just click and drag it and simply drop on this folder that is class 4 see so i have i have stored or i have put two sorry i have put one file and one folder inside this folder so now again double click and simply open it now you can see that there is one file that is microsoft document file if you want to open this file simply double click on this file see the file that you have created or you have saved it get open now if you want to open this folder simply double click on it now you can see that inside that folder again you are getting the soft folder again if you click on this particular folder again you are getting some of the soft folder in this way you can create a soft folder inside a folder and you can also store a file so this is how we place the folders that is soft folders or a files inside the folder see now let me show you once again how to create a folder simply right click the mouse button go to new option you will get another sub option in from this sub option simply click on this folder so see you will see a folder has been created with the name new folder simply type the name suppose say my folder so your folder and press enter key so you have got the name for this folder and just like I have said if you want to open the folder simply double click on it your folder gets open right now I don't have any file or sub folder inside this folder so what you need to do is you can simply click the mouse button drag it and place it inside the folder whatever you want to place it just simply drag and place inside the folder this way so what I have done is I have placed two folders let me refresh it so I have placed two folders and one file inside this folder that's my folder let me open as you can see you have got two folder and one Microsoft PowerPoint file so if you open this folder again you will get some more folder inside so in this way folder is very very helpful to arrange and manage files and soft folders so let me close it now how can you rename this folder suppose say I want to change the name of this folder from my folder so you can simply right click here just select it and right click the mouse button and go to rename option here let me repeat once again click on the folder then right click the mouse button and go to rename option here so now you can rename the folder suppose say I want to give this name as a um, chapter 3 and after typing the text simply press the enter key now see your folder has been renamed from my folder to chapter 3 so in this way you can rename the file you can rename the folder and creates and open the folder so i hope you have understood it going through this video you can practice at home how to create a file how to create a folder and how to put files and folder inside the newly created folder so thank you children and do practice it at home